Hello, I'm your zombie prince, Daryl Ambrose, resurrected for another stream of fun. I figured since we finished another game, it would be best to just take a break for a minute and come back to our little zombies playthrough. I'm having a lot of fun doing this. It's fun just jumping from, from game to game, admittedly. It also provides a little bit of a break between, you know, bigger games. I know that the N64 Zelda games weren't particularly, you know, bigger games, but they were pretty fun, and, you know, they were major kind of playthroughs for here. And this cutscene is always uncomfortable. Yep, yep, mm-hmm. Really? Jessica, everybody. Oh my. Game. What do you say? You bring over those prints and we can make up. Yes. Hey, Jackie Vincent. You want to know how I know that's Jackie Vincent? Because he never shuts up about how the fact that he's, you know, Jackie Vincent. He's looking into hey, there will be rabbit. Say we get together at the usual joint. Talk things through. Figure out a way to put this to bed before it gets out of hand. Jackie Vincent. Trust me. Have I ever steered you wrong before? Yes. Because you just shot the man in the back. Months. Hey, it's Floyd Campbell. I only got two weeks to train, but the outcome ain't in any doubt. See, it's Floyd. You know, honestly, I really like the story of the Shadows of Evil characters. I'm not going to be ever really able to show it fully, because I don't think you can do this easter egg solo, and right now I don't really have a crew, and I don't think I'll really ever have a crew that, uh, that would join me for this. I've done it one time many, many years ago. It's Jeff Goldblum! It's Jeff Goldblum! I know his name is Nero, but it's Jeff Goldblum. I actually wonder what character we'll be playing. Because I like all of them, except Floyd. I don't like Floyd Campbell. Insurance policies are, uh, up. Man, Jeff Goldblum could get his, like, two, like 30 seconds of cutscene without saying at least one, uh. Gosh dang it, Jeff Goldblum. I have been watching. And the Shadow Man. I have seen... Each and every one of your, of your misdeeds. I know, I know who you are. But, but questions, questions remain. remain. Why do you do, you do the, the things, things you, you do? do? You not see, not see the futility, futility of your tiny, tiny insignificant existence? You are, you are fragments, fragments of a bigger, bigger universe. universe. Your sins, sins serve only as, only as a gate invitation. An invitation to an evil, fond your imagination. I'll lead the way. Okay. I will I'll show you the path. path. Only me, of me, the Shadow, the Shadow Man. Man. Will you find your redemption? Okay. This this is actually gonna put a little little bit of perspective in. This is actually the reason that I have my little kind of jazzy theme for my intros and outros. Oh my, the my sensitivity has changed again. Why is it so low? It needs to be at least ten for me to enjoy it. You talking to me? Shut up. You talking to me? I'm Jackie Vincent. I should have played this solo, but nah, it's fine. All right. First things first. It wouldn't be me if I didn't want to show a, an out of bounds sequence breaky thing. You can jump on the car. You can jump up here. You can. What? There it goes. Zap that. Oh, nope, that's not a zappable. 
and can zap that. Sweet. Now, if you play your cards right, no it me with a pounding headache. you can actually get around the map without ever opening this first door. But I'm not... Did I seriously forget... I forgot the summoning key. Well, I can't say that I'm not an idiot. I can't believe I forgot to get the summoning key. Alrighty, well, that's embarrassing, but... Yeah, so if you try and actually go out the way I, I uh, just opened up there... I've turned into Jeff Goldblum with all the uhs. Did I not zap the quick revive machine? Am I really this incompetent? Well... Back off. I'm the one asking the questions. Shut up, Jackie Vincent. Yes, I'm going to say his full name, because the man never shuts up about it, so neither will I. Is a room of secrets. Do you know what I speak of? What is it, a serial killer's hideout? Well, the war a million dollars in the 30s? Uh, that's... That's quite a steep number. There it is. Let's play a game. Take a shot every time Jackie says his name. Actually, don't. He will be dead. You are cursed. The Keepers! Okay, speed cola. Juggernaut! This is the way I want to go. Ah, the Civil Protector! Also, the Civil Protector? Is this straight up a robot from Origins' head? Origins' is that feels weird to say, but I'm gonna go with it. Pop, pop! Stab. Pop, pop! Stab. Two shots and a knife. Goodness, the Bloodhound is... See, I didn't ever... Okay, when this game first came out, I didn't actually like Shadows of Evil all that much. I like it now, obviously, or else I you know, wouldn't want to be playing it. But Shadows of Evil has always been like a weird map for me, because I love the aesthetic, I love the music. But like... A lot of other stuff from this map, I'm not the biggest fan of. Darkness. Okay, I'm gonna jump up here, grapple up here, shock this, shock that, open this, even though I don't know if I'll be doing that this time. Smash those zombies with my tentacles. Ah, yes! Tentacles! Yes, I got it open. Okay, sweet. That was beau. Need to go away. Where is the mystery box? It's definitely not over here. Oh, that's lovely. Well. Stabbington. If I pick that up, more keepers will spawn. Uh, I thought I had more rounds than that. And I don't really you have the equipment to deal with keepers right now. Uh what am I doing? What am I doing? Akuda? Hey, magic. I'll take it. You know what this is? Don't hit me, because I don't have cook revive. I'm realizing how much of a mistake it is to not have Cook Revive, especially on this map where everything is like super closed in. You know, but these things kind of look cheap. They do. I mean, to be fair, I mean there is the whole stigma that all wrestling is 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 fake, and I'm not a huge I'm 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 not a huge fan. No, I'm not a fan of it at all myself. Eh, not my cup of tea. Of course not. I prefer video games over. Oops, that's a grenade. Oh, speaking of grenade, hang on. Ow. I've never been able to pull this off, so let's see. Nope. Messed that up. One, two, three. I'm going to be 
honest, I don't actually know what I'm supposed to be aiming for from here. Because there's supposed to be, like, something you knock down over there with a grenade and it and you pick it up and you get, like, 500 points. But I don't... I don't remember at all what it was. Or what it is, rather. Why is this so laggy all of a sudden? Why is... That's the wrong button. See, I used to play this with a different control scheme. So I'm a bit rusty with uh, the normal controls. I wonder. Can I? Ooh. It'll be close if I can do it. I'm not going to be able to pull that off. If I hadn't messed up the, the first tentacle whip. Pick up the summoning key. Someone slipped me a Mickey. A what? E. What? Is someone locked up? In your mortal hands, you now hold the summoning key. The summoning key. Can you find the items you need? Yeah, that's not helpful at all, Shadow Man. Why is this so laggy on stream? Hang on, is there something wrong? Do I? Hang on a minute. I've got to make sure that something is right. Because this is this is awful. Uh. I want to make sure. Oh, no wonder it's terrible. It's not using the right encoder. Probably. Maybe that'll fix some of the stuff that I'm having issues with. I hope. I'll keep an eye on it. Make sure that it isn't too, too stuttery and laggy. Uh, if it is, I will have to try and fix more. But... That's not a problem. I would much rather fix it now than have to suffer later. How are you looking on stream? Does that look good? Uh, I'm not noticing too much. Study read us. Yeah, I had it still set to my Wii U. As like the inca oops, the settings on my capture card were set for my Wii U instead of my instead of my other consoles. So. See, this is why you always test things before you push the button to go live. I did not, and I paid the price. Always make sure your equipment is working before you try to use it. Otherwise, you look unprofessional. And I hardly would say I'm a professional. I would at least like to, you know, uh, pretend I am? Pretend I do? Done, my friend. Alrighty. Now we can go get Jug. Man, the Kuda is actually really good. I kind of forgot how good this gun is. Okay. I don't know. How am I strong? It's for Jack and Long tonight. I don't know how to describe that taste, but... Oh no, parasites. You have blood in your hands. It cannot be cleansed. Your sins have allowed others to destroy their way into your heart. No. I do like the the Shadow Man as a character. I do like that he's basically the COD Zombies multiverse version of like the devil. As weird as that sounds, because like it fits him so well. And honestly, I think in lore it's like they're trying to say that he is the actual character. Like, it's, it's not just he's based on it, he actually just straight up is in the lore. But whether or not that's true, I'm not exactly sure. Ah, it is still being stupid and laggy on the stream. I'm not sure what's going on there. I don't know what's causing that. Because I'm not showing frame drops on my side. Um, I don't know. That's being... Okay. Well... I don't know what's going on. I hope it stables out. Because that's kind of upsetting. Nah, excuse me. Ooh, it's still a one knife. A sword flay. Which is beautiful. Ooh. This doesn't belong in the 30s. He says we'll have like a submachine gun from the, you know, future, even relative to our current time period. Semantics. Excuse you, zombie! That is me that you're trying to beat up. I did not grab a fumigator, but there's one right here. 
Is there a way to get a free park on this map? I actually don't know. Is there a way to get a free park on Shadows of Evil? I, I don't remember now that I'm actually, you know, sitting down for it. Really, a nuke? Why did you kill? Look, I killed a lot of people. Bad guys. You're gonna have to be Which a one? That is speed cola. I'm feeling a Margwa. I don't know why I'm feeling a Margwa, but I'm feeling a Margwa. Ooh, they're red now. I wonder if I can actually pull off getting the Apothecon Servant. Alrighty then. What do I want to do next? Do I want to go to the Burlesque? Do I want to go to the Boxing Gym? The... The Ruby Rabbit? Um... What is the Ruby Rabbit again? Is it basically just a... The, the, the brothel? Yeah, that felt uncomfortable to say. Was that Shadow Man just disappearing? Come on, dude! Stop staring! That's weird! Especially over uh, at the place that you were potentially standing hey, on. Down the chance at a little kickback, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? Ah. Uh, you see, part of me really wants to get Speed Cola, but then a part of me really wants to get Widow's Wine. Just because Widow's Wine is overpowered as heck. Do I want faster reloads or safety? Because I have Jug. And Jug and Widow's Wine is a ridiculous combo. Grapple up here. Run through. Shock this. Please open. Open! Jump down. Apparently missed the jump entirely. Great. Smash this. Smash that. Run, and hopefully... Got it! I hope. I used to be really good at being able to do an entire area with one, uh, one beast mode. Not so much anymore. I'm not exactly as practiced as I used to be. I don't go back and play Shadows of Evil much. It's, it's fun. I, like I said, I really love the aesthetic of the map. The music and, and everything else. I just never come back to it. Where the heck is the mystery box? Oh, it's in the stupid downtown district. Oh, the zombie shield. I need to get the zombie shield or the rocket shield. Cause it's not exactly a zombie shield, it's a rocket shield. Where is it? This is gonna be trying uh, fun trying to remember. Hey, there's one. I know it's in these upper bits that you have to open up with the beast mode. But that's about all I remember. Yep. Open this. Now smash that. Open this. Zap that. Hit this box off. And I believe... You can grapple this, drop there, grapple back. I think that's almost everything here. Hey, what do I want with a nice. Who invited you? Wait, I didn't power this up. Well, like I said, I'm not as good as I used to be with uh, opening up the entire area in one beast mode. I'm a little, ow, a little bit embarrassed. Keep your filthy claws away from me, freak. Especially since I wanted the mystery box. Okay, guess we're going the long way. And by long way, I mean opening another door. 
become the beast. Smash open these doors? I think if I'm fast enough, I might be able to get the waterfront district. Or the 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 the, 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 the burlesque district. The what's it called? Nope, I forgot where the, the hook was. Anyone else Sounds like I'm playing dead by daylight. I feel like I'm gonna puke. Oh, Dead by Daylight. That's a game that I have seen a lot of VTubers playing as of late. And I really wish that I liked it. Because I would love to be able to play it, but I, um... I'm not good at it, and it is... You don't want to see me rage, do you? I hope not. Okay! I love the, I love the design of the SVG-100. Scalable vector graphics. All right, so now we just have one last... Oh, wait. Okay, actually, the SVG-100 might be a really good idea. Uh, might be a really good gun to have for what's coming up. So the problem is, on my end, everything is running super smooth. So I don't know what's going on between here and, and the stream. Maybe... Okay, I'm going to try something one more time. See if I can, you know, maybe fix this. Nope, oh, that's the wrong button. That button is it. I'm going to reduce the quality from, from my capture card. And see if maybe that helps. I know it's kind of annoying and I apologize that I have to. At least at a 720. But I have a feeling that maybe that's the problem. Okay, now I'm feeling a Margwa. Yep, I hear a Margwa. Okay, maybe the SVG wasn't as good as I thought. Because I remember this thing being a lot better. Actually, that, that didn't seem to do much at all. In fact, I think that made it worse, reducing the quality. I don't know what's going on. I'm a little bit sad by this. I've been shot three times in the line of duty. Takes more than a scratch to bother me. Okay, game. Am I gonna have to go into beast form and smack the Margwa a few times? Okay, buddy. Slip through the zombies. I don't like that. I'm scared of the zombies. Hitting me in the back. The, the SVG 100, back when snipers were actually good in this series. Okay, okay Margwa, I see you. I see you, buddy. Hello, Margaret. I kind of want a Margwa. Like, I'm plushy of a Margwa. I think Glitching Queen years ago had, had like, Margwa plushes. You have to shoot the Margwa when its mouth is open to actually damage it. Otherwise, you're just wasting a ammo. You also have to, you know, hit it, or else you're wasting ammo. And, you know, case in point, again, you have to actually hit it. That Margwa is very angry at me. Fight, huh? Why do I keep missing? I have a sniper rifle! Their whole thing is accuracy! Really? Did he close his mouth just as I shot? Shut up. On Margwa. This is why I like Revelation so much. It's because you are easy to kill there. On Shadows of Evil, you are a little bit scary. Hey, that's I don't like this. Running from a Margwa because I'm terrified. He's dead. Good. That. You are gonna regret that real soon. I want the Margwa heart. Thank you, game. Who 
Oof. You must confess. Ah. That was an experience. See, I love it when they have mini bosses and zombies. Because I know I've said my praise for George. Well, since that did basically nothing, I'm going to up the quality again. Because I'm not sure exactly what's going on here. So I'm not dropping frames. I'm wondering if it's just literally on my end watching the stream. And if it is, I'm just making a mountain out of a molehill, I guess. Or literally making something of nothing. Because if it's not an issue and I've just been doing this, I apologize. But I can only deal with what I've... Or I can only uh, go off of what I've been seeing and what I've been told, so... It's okay. I really hope it's not too bad. Because I guess as long as my end isn't saying I'm dropping frames in my OBS, it's it's probably fine. I don't want to harp on this, though. Uh, what am I doing? There was also a weird glitch, if I remember right. Back when the map first released. There was a lot of weird glitches, so that's not really descriptive. But, uh, you could actually, like, buy things as the beast form. Where everything looked a little different when I was and it happen. was like a way to glitch out and get more perks and weapons and the like. I don't know if weapons, but you could at least get stuff without opening areas. If you knew what you were doing. They patched it pretty early on, though, so don't expect it to, like, actually work anymore. Speaking of, you drop down here. I don't know what that was a speaking of, but that's eh, fine. What's uh, what's a bit of I uh, guess uh, stupidity among the uh, the V tipper? I don't know. <laughs> Alrighty, zombies. I'm finally back in my groove of zombies because it's. I cannot believe that I failed on Origins the other day. Like that was annoying. That really left a bad taste in my mouth. After having that really fun, you know, save with the with the robot, I was upset so much. Jackie B claims that a minor victory. Okay, I should probably maybe you know start on actually, um, you know, opening up the pack a punch machine and doing the rituals for the pack a punch. Is this meatballs? Why do I feel like this is meatballs? This is meatballs! Great! Oh no. Fun fact! That it's pretty obvious if you know multiplayer. These things have the exact AI as uh, wraps from multiplayer in Black Ops 3! Zombie, or zombies. Black Ops 3, uh, just in general. Die, meatball! Ow! Meatballs! Did that meatball just roll over the other meatball? Also, it's really fun to say the word meatball. Okay. Jump up and grab that. Oh yeah, free ammo. Well, that's good. Good. Now, I want to build the zombie shield. There it goes. Yeah, oh, I've only crafted five buildables? Oh, purple pod, purple pod, purple pod, purple pod. The Margua tentacle right off the bat? I'll take it. I will absolutely take it. Feels weird, though. Because usually I gotta go at least, like, five purple pods before I can get the Margua tentacle. Enter. Whoa, someone trying to help us? Hey, can I 
get one of these Gatling gun kind of things? Ooh, actually, this is pretty good on this map now that I remember. Okay, I've got the shield. I've got... I think I can do things. I mean, I'm a little bit worried that I'm starting these on round 11. But... In any place in this city, your paths are crossed here. Oh, this place? I want to not die, first of all. No, I want to not die, first of all. Well, that was, uh... Good use of the rocket shield. Okay. Yeah, I've gotten pretty used to uh, using the rocket shield like that to, like, try and help me get out of corners. I, admittedly, I shouldn't be as good at that as I am, because you shouldn't be putting yourself in corners in COD Zombies. It's not a good or smart thing to do. Zombie, leave me alone, please. Ah, yes. You know, the gate worm. The sacred place? What is this, the sacred, sacred realm again? Place. Really? Then what? Some worm monster comes for its babies? Four must be collected. Only then we prevent the destruction of your people. Hey, the haymaker is going to be good for killing margwas. I know I don't have it unlocked yet for, for uh, attachment purposes. Mm. Forget it. I'm doing it. Uh oh. First of all, I want to mean make sure I'm not, you know, gonna die. Hi, buddies. Want to make sure I'm not gonna die. You got a lot of nerve, creep. Get out of here, silly zombies. Uh, I guess I'm no stranger to the sudden appearance of new evidence. Okay. the fact that Jackie V completely revels in the fact that he is just a scumbag. And I know that sounds weird to say, but like, like he, he... The genre of film noir, which this is kind of playing on, is like, you know, the corrupt detective is kind of a, a, a popular trove. Hi, keepers. Ah, heck. You're my partner, Jackie. Okay, if this place is what I think it is... Oh, not this again! I forgot about him spawning after two rituals. At least shotguns are good against the Margwa. That's really why I wanted the KRM or the Haymaker earlier. Margwa, where are you going? You're just zipping around the place like you own it. I'm not letting any of your heads take a bite out of me. Don't mess with me. I'm Jack Vincent. Oh, yeah. As soon as you open that mouth, you're dead, buddy. Open up. I have a death machine. Loser. Okay. I'd give you all a final warning, but I think I'd rather just put you down. I want to do this one next. Actually, do I? Because they'll be fighting a Margo down at the docks, but I'm already here, so I'm just gonna go for it. We're going for it. It's gonna be real fun. I'm guessing this will belong to Bookworm. Bookworm? Hey, I'm not ready to call the stage yet, yet. Yeah, this one I actually consider one of the more difficult ones to survive. But, I mean, even then, it's still pretty easy. 
This is my problem with Shadows of Evil. It takes a long time to actually open up Pack-a-Punch. Oh, what is that? From the shadows. Spot the Shadow Man five times in one game. Oh, I got an achievement. Cool. I wasn't expecting to get an achievement, but uh, I'll take it. I will definitely accept it. I mean, I know achievements don't mean anything, but they're cool. Yeah, I think I will end up with the with the place. What's it called? This is not open. Widow's wine. That's it. Also, where are trip mines? Where are the trip mines at? Is that trip mines on the wall? No. No, that was trip mines. Okay, so there they are. Okay, I can use this beast mode to run over and potentially open up spawns room. I hope that counted. I heard the sound effect go off you for the whip of the weird. tentacles. I'm getting used yeah, to it feels weird to say the word tentacles. Honestly, tentacles is just a this this strange word. I'm gonna roll with it. Huh? Oh, I forgot that you could actually recharge the shield. The ah, this is an area I know well. But not from Shadows of Evil again. It's because a lot of other times when uh, my crew would drop in Blackout, we would also drop here. Because for some reason, this place had an un... Un, uh, you got a problem? Take it I don't know, with a, a, a stupid amount of times where the zombies would spawn there at the start of the game. And if you got in and you got a bowie knife and started taking out the zombies, you could also pretty much wreck other players that tried to drop here with you. In Blackout, I loved Blackout. I really wish it had been the, been the Battle Royale for COD as opposed to... Warzone, as I've said before. Oh! Beginning of the end, I got another achievement! Shadows of Evil complete all rituals. Sweet! Now, I want to kill this Margwa before I actually go put these worms where they're supposed to be. This is your last chance? You got my wife beat. Give up quiet! She has two faces! Ah, uh, heck. I don't have a shield, so I need to go over here. Okay, am I going crazy, or was there a thing, like, where the Margwa could vomit on things? Or am I am I thinking of... No, that's the... That's the Blightfather in Black Ops 4. Uh, how did you not die? Okay, that could have been dangerous. How did you not get hurt there, buddy? Really? No! That's not good. Help me. I do the same for you. I'm gonna make a that's not great, and that's even worse. That shut you up? Yeah, it did. Okay, I want to get Jug first before yeah, anything. That a minor victory. This is not Jug. Uh oh. What's that? Margwa party? Kill two Margwas in a single round? Okay, I'll take it. Poor Margwa. Actually, no, not poor Margwa. He downed me. What am I saying poor Margwa for? Finn O'Leary's whiskey tasted better than this. Finn O'Leary shout out! Yo! Mob of the Dead mobsters! Again, corrupt police officer Jackie Vincent. Not a detective, but still kind of playing on that trope of corruption. Oh heck, I'm gonna die if I get out, if I don't get out of here. Oh, okay. How do I live and how do I get my perks again? This is a dangerous place to be. Anywhere's better than here. Please let me go. City looks a whole lot better from up here. Whew. You know, this is why I like zombies maps that have fast travels. If 
The Blast Radius Theater. Okay. I really do like the art deck. Oh my goodness! The art deco style of this map. I love it. It's got that like, I don't know, grungy. Reminds me of like depictions of of Gotham City. And while I'm not a huge Batman fan or DC fan in general. I really do like the depictions of Gotham City in the comics and in the Batman animated series from the 90s. Oh, crumpets, this is terrifying. I've been shot three times in the line of duty. Takes more than a scratch to bother me. Come on, zombies, I don't want to be here. Okay. This has turned into a difficult situation. Because... My Kuda... Actually, my Kuda's still doing pretty good. What am I talking about? But I do need to get Cook Revive. Stab! I don't have a Gobble Gum! I need to get a new gobble! A oh, gobble, gobble, gobble. Oh my gosh, that's a that's a joke that uh me and my friend group used to make. It was a song from well not from, but it was in GTA 5 and hmm. Honestly, I never knew the actual words to it. So I would just say gobble gobble gobble. Because that's that's what it sounded like to me. And I never actually took the time to look up what the soda was soda? What the song was actually called. I was I was reading Revive Soda and said the word soda. I never actually took the time to look up what the song was called or what the actual lyrics were, so it's just become the gobble 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 song. As of late. Okay. As of late, uh, since then. Now then it's time. It's time for Animaniacs. I'm the one the oh, talk about 90s animated series. This is goodness. To be fair, Animaniacs was amazing. And open the rift. <laughs> Always done swiftly. There's a weird gobble gum. Because it's not all that useful. And I want to use another beast mode here. Open up this. Smash that. And then I want to come up here, zap this. Open up that. And then I want to just try this, just to see if I can get it. Uh, zero, four, three, I don't know. There's no like, way to- oh, you can return to human form? I was about to say, there's no way to force return to human form, but apparently there was. What just happened? Someone slipped me a Mickey? Okay, I have a joke about this place. So what, I'll just leave it here? Yep, I never have felt comfortable doing that wall run. Never once in my life. Are these worms gonna fix everything? So, are because these it worms always feels like I'm going to do <laughs> oh, I no. see it. We're all in this together. Well Maybe it's not the wall run I should have been worried about. You help me out. Doesn't mean I owe you anything. Uh, game. Well, this is why I don't like this room. Yeah, I'm not supposed to drink on the job, you know. This is my last quick revive. I can't believe I just did that. I really can't. That's... Ah, uh, that... Uh, yeah. 
I genuinely can't believe that that just happened. After all the stupid, crazy stuff I've pulled off, that's what killed me? Falling into a bottomless pit? Damn. Finn O'Leary's whiskey tasted better than this. Ah, there's the censoring that I have enabled. <laughs> Again, I just I'm not a huge fan of uh, swearing, yeah, so I just kind of the if there's an option to turn it off, I will take it. But it's uh, eh. I don't know. It's just not for me. I don't find it entertaining very much. Well, yeah, very much. This song. I don't know if you can hear it very well. I know it's Latin. Now, I know it's Latin. Ego, ego, spiro, habito. Ego, ego, spiro, existo. He's appreciated. Just got a whole lot worse. Yeah, definitely did, Jackie Vincent. Now we got this red filter over everything now. Not going down without a fight, huh? Did I kill you already? Okay, so Fun fact! Margwas used to be a lot worse when this game first released. No, don't you dare slam down! I think my... I think my time playing Revelations has really made me forget how difficult Margwas actually are. Just because Revelations' whole thing is, Hey, it's the end of the world. You're overpowered. Kill everything. There's a reason it's one of my favorite maps. Because it's... I'll never, I'll never say no to a good power fantasy. That Marquez head is not glowing, so I didn't know it was open. Margwa, Margwa, can I call you Margie? I'm never gonna call you Margie. Never mind. Okay, I see that that has offended you. I'm sorry. I, I will never call you Margie again. I'll never call you that name again, rather. Would your head just die, please, Margwa? Oh, uh, thank you. See, all you have to do is ask nicely and Margwa's die. Get out of here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. You creep. Creep? What? Stupid zombie. Get out of here. You silly undead flesh addict. I don't know. It does not sound intimidating when I say it, but when Dempsey does it, he gets all the praise in the wild. You sh why zombies? I can get my back to them. Open this up just as soon as I can. I almost went down again, but because I can use the shield pretty good, admittedly. Okay, I can't even say that that was pretty good. That was really just luck. Case in point. I need to get out of here. This is too too tight. Too tight for my liking. Ooh, okay. Oh yeah, let's go to down here where it's even worse. If I'm correct, this is actually based on a fictionalized, like, 30s version of Chicago. Hi, Parasite. Parasite, you scared me. I thought you were a zombie. Ooh, 
Ooh, I unlocked a new reticle for my reflex sight. Sweet. Are you the last zombie? If you are, then I shall take advantage of this time. Ah, it's all Richtofen's hideouts. Ah, the stuffed monkey. Or the taxidermied monkey, rather. There is a difference. Taxidermied means it was once alive. Stuffed is more like a toy. Gosh, I don't like doing this room. I don't like this room. I really, really don't. Some are gonna get to see how Dagon's glare. Hey, runes, Dagon? That's a Elder Scrolls reference. Wow. That's a series that I might be interested in trying to play on the channel. I've never actually played the story of any of the any of the Elder Scrolls games. And if I do, I will be playing modded versions, of course. I'll create a, a nice little mod pack to make it cool. I've got I've got some mods in mind for Skyrim. That would be fun to show on stream. Especially given one of the mods is something that kind of ties in what we've done already. Oh, hi, zombie. What we've been playing here on the channel. And if you know that mod, I'm not going to spoil it in case I do decide to uh, play it on the channel. Hi, zombies. I ain't backing down. It's really hard to try and commentate while also trying to make the split-second decisions needed in COD Zombies. But I'm having a lot of fun. I'm getting back into the swing of it, I guess. It's, a, uh, It's an experience. You have the right to shut your trap. Yo! That's the perfect way to read the Miranda rights. Actually, it's not, because I'm pretty sure it's illegal to, you know... Not, uh, not say them verbatim. Could be wrong, but fairly certain that's a, probably a liability. <laughs> but just casually dropping, yeah, you have your right to shut your trap. Sounds like super cool. Fits Jackie V to a T. That was not supposed to be as, as comical as it was. the other maps go faster than shadows. Oh, yeah, meatballs and parasites. Does that see no matter? Well, things just changed. Things just changed a lot with how this game is going to go. Because I have all three parts of the Apothecon Servant. This area is condemned. And... Okay, that's... That's great and all, but that's not exactly what I wanted. Say goodbye to the CUDA... And hello to the most overpowered weapon in this series. I know I said that the Elf or Siege is my favorite. The Apothecon Servant is busted. You give me a map where I can get the Apothecon Servant, the Elf or Siege, and... Um... I don't know. I don't know what I want my third weapon to be. Yeah, you give me a map where I can have those and... Yeah, I would be a very, very happy individual. <laughs> a very happy zombie. Not like these guys. Just gonna... Small train. These guys. so I can actually show this. Goodbye, zombies. 
Nar Ulaqua. Oh no. I looked over at stream for a split second. You know, it looks cooler to fire the shotgun in a... Do I have a shield? No, I do. In... Without ADSing? I was gonna say third person, but... Oh! Huh! Oh. I'm gonna get a new gobble gum, since mine just ran out. Where we at? In plain sight! That's a nice one. Why am I zooming? You know, it feels weird that Shadows of Evil wouldn't have a, a free perk, Easter egg. But I can't think of it. Thing is not as good as I remember it. It could be that it just doesn't have the attachments that I remember it having. That's a zombie. Yeah, yes, that is a zombie. Thank you for your your recognition skills, me. Okay. Yep. Now we gotta deal with this. Oh, yeah. I have the Apothecon Servant. What am I worried about? If I get into a corner, I just shoot at the ground and everything dies. Okay, get me a new shield. Let the round get sucked up. So the Apothecon server is just a zombie vacuum. <sighs> Got this. It's just round 17. It's not that bad. I think I've mentioned this before, but my highest round I've ever gotten is 145. Huh. And, uh, that was... That was a long game. Getting to round 145. I didn't do it all in one sitting, for the record. Because that was like a 12-hour total game. And I was so scared that I was going to get disconnected from the servers and it wasn't going to count the entire time I was playing. Luckily, though... I managed to pull it off. I got credit for it. And now it stands a permanent record on my, uh... On my zombies, uh, accomplishments board. No, zombies! Leave me alone, please. Thank you. Yeah, I'm focusing on Margaret right now. Margaret the Margua. That was an old community, the uh, zombies community thing. Back when Revelations came out. I don't remember who started Margaret the Mar- Oh, I wish I hadn't used a shot from this. I don't remember who started Margaret the Margua and Kevin the Keeper. I think I want to say it was Mr. Dalek JD, but I'm not sure. I know it wasn't Mr. Ruffle Waffles. Because Milo, Mr. Ruffle Waffles, was always more uh, serious. It was always a mo okay. And uh, oh, man, old zombies YouTube was was uh, something else. It was actually NG, a, a channel called NGT Zombies. 
that got me into into the zombies lore and storyline. Spider bite. What's his uh, was the guy that ran its name? And he did all these like these videos called the uh, NGT Zombies the Learning Channel. NGT eh, eh. NGT Zombies TLC basically. And it was always like uh, this, like taking stuff that like maybe Ted said at some point on like the bus and was like, hey, let's dive into why he actually was talking about this place and all the conspiracies surrounding it and all the real world stuff too. And it was, it was always super fun to, I want one. There we go. This is what you love to see. Get machine. Get out of here, zombies. Yeah, death machine drops are, uh... You know, I didn't actually expect there to be a death machine power-up icon specific for this map. Because for those that don't know, Death Machines weren't initially on every Black Ops 3 Zombies map. They really only came in with the Heisendrach. Hmm. Like it was a big, it was a big deal when they came back in the community. I should have just taken the stairs. Now that I, now that I think about it, is this gonna be a zombie round or are we doing a parasite? Okay, it's a, it's a zombie round for our last round here on Shadows of Evil. Even though the first thing that spawned in was a meatball. Silly meatball. A boom. Let's see what this gives me. Ooh, insta kill. Insta kill. Stabbed. Ooh, what's this one gonna give me? I like loot boxes. Not like actual loot boxes, but more like seeing what the like the dig site the dig sites and origins kind of stuff. I don't like loot boxes. Oh, sorry. I don't like surprise mechanics. Let's see how do I get a uh oh a fire sale. But I just remembered I got it from the pod thing. Because normally you can only get fire sails after you move the mystery box. What? I didn't move the game? See what I mean about the Apothecon Servant just saving you if you ever get in a corner? This weapon is ridiculous. I... Hear him. Alrighty. It's time to go to the giant. I'm just gonna end it. Yeah, but as I was saying at the start of the map, the Shadows of Evil is actually the kind of reason that I uh, chose the music that I did from my start and in my end screens. Because I love that that jazzy theme, and you can really tell with my with my outro music that I use. If you know Shadows of Evil a lot. What do you get? Yeah, I don't think I'll be prestiging. Uh, when the time comes around, because there's not really much of a point anymore. Because I'm not going to be trying to grind for Master Prestige again. I've already done that once. A long, long time ago in another life. But I will put on the attachments. Uh, yeah. Put that on. 
I unlock the dingo? You're kidding me. I'll put Amethyst on this. Uh, let's see what I actually did for my shotguns. Oh wow, I didn't level this thing up at all. Great. Gobble gum? Ooh. And nothing good. Alright, change into the giant. I set the world on fire. Conquered the giant. Oh, this cutscene. I have seen it so many times and I still love it. Every single time I see it, I love this cutscene. Exactly what we say. I love Richtofen. Not this Richtofen. This this Richtofen's insane and more evil than the other one. You must awaken the test subjects. Then again, I'm a huge fan of Nolan North. Yeah, huge fan of Nolan North. So it's Takeo. I respect. I respect you, man. I really do. But what are you going to do to a machine with your katana? The Path of Sorrows. Whatever you're thinking of doing, don't do it! I like how you can hear kind of the whispers of like the Shadow Man or whatever voices that Ultimus Richtofen hears in his head. I thought we were done with this! Dempsey. Things change. Only a fool would dare to change history. Oh, fool. What I do, I do only to secure a better tomorrow. Yeah? Well, let's see if we live to see it. I love these four characters. They're so legendary. Honestly, I know this might not be a popular take, or really even like a, a take that most people... Well, I guess that's the definition of popular. I'm stupid. But I really, really, really think that the four zombies characters, the OG characters, really belong up there with some of the legendary characters. Like, this is going to sound blasphemous if you don't know these characters, but I think they belong up there with... with likes of like Mario and Sonic and, and Link. And I know it sounds weird considering, you know, that Todd Zombies was basically just a spin-off. It wasn't even really supposed to exist. Like, it was just supposed to be Nocturne Toten. Nocturne Toten. And we got so much further. We got so much out of this. It's crazy. Like, this, this series is awesome. I absolutely love it. Curse this confusion. I, I must, I must remember, remember why, why I am here. here. The enemy war machine must, must be, be destroyed. destroyed. Okay, is audio a bit loud for you guys? Because I'm going to turn it down to about 70%. Maybe that'll turn it down, because it was a little loud. I hope it wasn't too bad on, on Shadows of Evil. Okay, is it bad that I saw that and thought immediately, hey, I need to get rid of the apparatus? So I've been playing too much Lethal Company with, with uh, some of my friends. 
Yeah, Lethal Company's fun. I hope that one day I can play it here on the channel. Because it is, it's hilarious. We've the, we've got a mod pack that we play with. Nikolai, I really don't think now is the time for a political... A political discussion, buddy. He's through Soviet way! Stabbed. That double points helped me make bank goodness! Come on, what we got? Anywhere but here! Sweet. Aww. Nick, I'm sorry, I'll give you candy. Just don't be sad. Don't be sad anymore, Nikolai. You're too much of a of a of a character to be sad. Of a fun character. Really? The mystery box is up on the cat? Look! I thought it was Okay. Okay, that's uh that's not great. I need a gun. I know that there's a gun right outside of that little alleyway, so I'm gonna try to slip through here. Oh, a jug! Sweet! Oh, it's the Vesper. Nikolai, wait until you- really? Wait until you learn about Japanese vending machines, Nick. It's, uh... Honestly? The Japanese vending machines are super cool. It's, I mean, you have normal ones, and then you've got the weird ones, and then you've got the weird ones. And this is gonna sound weird too, but I was watching that anime of uh, reincarnated as a vending machine. I did not expect that show to be as good as it was. I didn't read the manga, or I'm presuming it has a light novel. But I just, I didn't ever read it, and so I was just going in with the, with the idea of, oh boy, this is, this is gonna be another, another isekai story. Where it's just like, a random reincarnation thing. But no, it turned out to be really super good. Like, crazy good. I was thoroughly impressed by it. And then I watched Reincarnated as a Sword, and I loved that. I think it was confirmed for a season two, but I'm not certain. Like, I haven't seen any announcement, like, of a release date, if it was. I need to look more into that, though, because I liked that show. Aww. Teacher. Teacher is best sword. <sighs> yeah. I'm really sleepy today. This time change has really got me messed up. I don't understand why we do it still. Like, it's... I don't know, it feels... It feels really stupid. To be changing time. Alright, zombie. At least I've got the Vesper. It's not a good gun at all. But I like it. Hey, look, it's a cipher. It's upside down, too. I don't actually know if uh, a lot of the ciphers on this map were... We're, uh... We're... What's the word I'm looking for? Solved. That's what I'm trying to think of. I couldn't think of the word solved. Goodness. Ooh! Dog round! Did I get the points from this? I did not. Unleashed to the dogs of war! 
Sorry, Fluffy. I did not mean to hurt you. I laughed. There you are. Man, that was some, like, pro-level multiplayer flick there. Good gravy. I can't believe I actually did that. That was... Like, the dog... The, the dog didn't even touch me, and, and I just, like, flicked and killed it. That was wild. I don't think I've ever done that before. Okay, I, I'm gonna speak on that. I've been watching like, clips from, uh, professional COD players in Modern Warfare 3. And it's like, why are you playing the game like this? Is, is this really all that fun to just constantly be on, like, sliding and flicking, like, this? it's crazy. I'm like, you know this is supposed to be fun, you're not supposed to be, like, trying this hard, right? And I, I feel bad even thinking like that, but seriously, it's... It's kind of crazy. Ooh, leveled up the Vesper! She's a beauty! Ah, heck. That's not great. Uh-oh. Okay. What am I doing? What am I doing, honestly? Because I'm not sure. I mean, uh, hey, the Icarus from All of the Dead. I always forget that that's up there. I remember there were a lot of theories about why you could see it flying over in Shadows of Evil and why it ended up here. Back when this game first came out, and honestly, was that the RPK? I didn't know the RPK was on this map. They must have added it after Chronicles came out, Zombie Chronicles. Because it was not on here initially. It was not... Well, obviously, the gun wasn't in the game initially. Yep, this is why I love sniper rifles in COD Zombies. These things can be either the most busted thing in existence, or they can be Cold War. And... Like, that's my biggest complaint with Cold War is... Ooh, Mule Kick's in the bad spot. So that's actually good. Cold War's sniper rifles suck so much. I mean, they take forever to scope in. You miss if you're not scoped in. And in zombies, they only go through like one or two zombies. And you know, here I just killed three zombies with one bullet. Zombie, what are you doing? And, like, it doesn't make sense because, uh... Oh, yeah, I have a 50 caliber sniper rifle. Okay. These are half-rotten zombies. My bullet only goes through one of them. Oops. It makes no sense. I mean, yes, I know, don't try to bring logic into COD zombies, but at the same time... Like, every other game in the series has had, you know, bullets go through zombies basically an infinite amount if it's a sniper rifle. So it's kind of jarring and feels really, really unfun. And I get that it's because they had to balance it with multiplayer. I understand that. Because even a multiplayer bullet can only go through, like, one or two players, even if they're, like, standing in a line in Cold War. Like, you could have the entire team standing in a perfectly lined up line. But in Cold War, you, you only kill, like, two of them with a bullet. And it's so stupid. Should I be 
standing so close to and, but they put that in zombies and it ruined snipers. Like Black Ops 2, Black Ops 3, Black Ops 4 sniper rifles are amazing. Like honestly, you can genuinely have a sniper rifle as a viable weapon in 2, 3, and 4. And not so much 1, but that's just because every weapon in Black Ops 1 sucked. With the exception of, like, three. And even then, they don't compare to to Black Ops 2 onward. Excuse you, zombie! You dare touch me, minion! Oh wait, I'm playing as Nikolai. But yeah, I just... I don't know, I will never understand why they decided to change sniper rifles for for Cold War. And even more, why they decided to make them not fun anymore. Because you can pull off some fun stuff in, in COD Zombies with a sniper rifle. Case in point. But when they, I don't know, it's just, I, I keep saying the same thing over and over again, but it's just because I'm genuinely that upset that Cold War just ruined sniper rifles. And then Modern Warfare 3 ruined zombies, so I guess it can, it, it tracks, as sad as it is. I will never understand what they were thinking when making Modern Warfare 3 zombies. I played it during the free weekend. It took me three games to actually understand it. Like, three matches. And even then, I was like, this is not fun. This genuinely is not fun. Like, it, it, it just felt like... I don't know, it didn't feel like zombies. It felt like... Warzone. And I know a lot of people gave Cold War flack for that feeling of zombies feeling like multiplayer instead of zombies. But it wasn't that bad in in Cold War. I mean, yeah, the, the sniper sucked, but... Honestly, I thought Cold War was fine. It wasn't as good as, as 3 and 4, in my opinion. Because, again, I'm, like, the only person on Earth that apparently liked Black Ops 4. Didn't like it at the start, because Black Ops 4 at the start deserves all the hate that that game got. But after they fixed it, it was a completely different game. I consider Black Ops 4's start, like, released Black Ops 4 and, and fixed Black Ops 4 to be entirely different games. Like, Black Ops 4 on release was comparable to, like, Cyberpunk with how much that game functioned. Cyberpunk and, uh... <laughs> no Man's Sky. Because those three games were just broken on release. Honestly, I've heard the Cyberpunk is still broken, even after all the patches. And I've never gone back and actually played it again. But I don't exactly have a lot of... want to... So this is gonna sound hypocritical given that, you know, Black Ops 4 is one of my favorite zombie games and it released in a broken state. But, like, when a game releases that badly, it kind of turns you off from ever wanting to try it. I want to get a new weapon. What do you got for me, Box? Okay, I wanted a weapon, not a bludgeoning stick. But I'll take it, because it's better than a Vesper. Come on. Okay, that's not a weapon either. That's a glorified pool cue. Really? You suck, game. I was just... I was being nice to your younger brother. And now you're just gonna be mean to me? I see how it is. No, it's fine. 
to if I care. I own several collector's editions of you game, but no, fine. You know what? It's fine. I don't. I don't mind. Jerk. Baka. It's not like I wanted a good weapon or anything. Baka. Oh, oh dear. Sundere <laughs> Daryl. Sundero. <gasps> Sundero. Oh my gosh, I gotta use that. I will be using that in the future. That'll be fun. Uh, zombies? Oh, I hear you. Getting no scope. Or is that a black scope? I don't actually remember, like, the terms for scoping. I had a friend who was, like, super big into, like, to the point where he said he was almost competitive level back in Black Ops 2. I'm pretty sure that was a lie, though, because we were, like, kids. I'm pretty sure he was just trying to clout pull with me. And to be fair, I'm not exactly the most, um, ungullible person. Oh, I didn't get a reward? What'd I do all that work for if I didn't get a reward? Game? To be fair, I mean, the reward is the Pack-a-Punch machine, so... See what I mean about sniper rifles just being fun? It's like, they're... They're, they're basically a, a, a cannon. You get up a line of zombies, and then you just... Pop! Pop goes a zombie! They are so ammo efficient, too. As long as you're not, you know, aiming for one zombie at a time. They're so much fun to use. Better than this thing ever will be. But to be fair, this thing's a burst, a burst LMG. Like, a burst assault rifle? Makes sense. Burst SMG? Makes sense. Burst LMG? Why? Why? Who does this benefit? Does it benefit me? No. But I will pack a bunch of it. I think it's called like the Elder Invader. No, that's that's not what it's called. Iken Hisatsu. Iken Hisatsu? What is that? I hope I'm not swearing in Japanese now that I'm thinking about it. Uh, until I know what this gun is called, I will not be saying that name again, because I don't want to be swearing. Uh, until I know what this gun's name means, rather. Oi! Zombie! Stop it. Get some help. Oh, yep, this is why we don't use a burst SMG, or LMG. It's heavy, and it's a burst fire. It's just not good. That is. That reminds me of another gun that everybody considered terrible in my friend group. But I really liked it. It was the Gorgon. Not the Gorgon. The... Gorgon? No. Oh... Dang it, I can't remember what it was called now. I can see what it looks like, but I... I can't remember the name. Anyhow, it was the really slow-firing 50 cal LMG from, uh... Black Ops 4. Everyone in my friend group hated that weapon. But I kind of liked it. Because it just, you know, it was a little bit terrible. I'll give it that. But in, uh... In Blackout, you could do some fun stuff with it. Oh, man, when we get to Black Ops 4, I'm going to have to show off my other favorite zombies weapon. This is what my third zombies weapon was I was trying to think of earlier. The the auger, DMR. D DMR? D or something. It was called the auger in Black Ops 4. Thing had a basically, as, far, as fast as you could pull the trigger, that thing could shoot. Fire eight. And it had super high range. To the point where it was, well, it was considered a tactical rifle, but I always used it as a sniper, and in Blackout, ow, excuse you, 
its ammo was super cheap. It was it was uh seven seven point six two ammo instead of the point three three eight or fifty cal. So it was the ammo was everywhere, and you could you could shoot that thing from basically across the map and hit somebody. And it, you could literally just spam it. It was crazy. I would, I would compare it to the the Draken in Black Ops Three, the sniper rifle, the Draken, Draken, Draken. Like that's how good it was. And to be fair, the Draken is like the best sniper rifle we've ever gotten in in a COD Zombies history. Actually, okay. In terms of fire rate, it is. But my favorite um, sniper rifle in this series has to belong to the Havelina AA-50 from Black Ops 4. Black Market Weapons. Thing was crazy. But Nikolai first! Anything is better than this. Ooh, and I got the Icker. One at time for slaughter. Okay, what we get? Uh, ooh, the Argus. This is also a good gun. I've been singing this gun's praises since Nocter on Toten, honestly. Hello, little fluffy dog. Yeah, meet your demise. Thank you. This machine appears to follow our every step. Listen to the sound of this gun, though. Oh, it's beautiful. And with double tap too, I mean you're doubling your damage output because it's splitting your bullet into two midair. So it's just, oh. Honestly, Double Tap 2.0 was one of the most overpowered perks they've ever made. Nah, Nikolai. Nikolai is not soft. Nikolai is big man. No, yet is is not. Big man like that, he's, he's big strong man. Nah. Not big soft man. Yeah. Alrighty. Three more rounds. Well, four. 17, 18, 19, and 20. So yeah, four rounds. And potentially one of them is going to be a dog round, so... Really, only about three zombie rounds. I just about bit my tongue and it hurt. Hey, Argus level two. I kind of managed to get two extremely powerful weapons. Oh, I finished a daily challenge. Sweet. Whoa, hi, zombie. What are you doing? What are you doing? Zombie, leave me alone, please. Come on now. Be nice to me. Come on. Anywhere but here. Wow, I didn't actually go that far. To be fair, I mean, this map is pretty small by Black Ops 3 standards. And I still managed to get the max ammo. Look at that. That was cool. That felt cool. 
Round 18. Dog round? Dog round. I was kind of hoping this would be round 20. But, eh, it's fine. I know we've already played Der Riese, but again, this map is different than Der Riese. It has a different story, a little bit different layout, different stuff you can do, even though I, I didn't actually show it. This is a, this is a, plays differently. Because there is an Easter egg. Huh, excuse me. All, yeah. Easter egg! Wait! I want to do a game. Let's play, Let's play hide, hide and seek. And seek. Those for her exact words. See, the problem is I don't remember where these these hide-and-seek objects actually spawn. I, I'll try and, and uh, actually get them, but I don't remember where they are. I think I know where one is. Maybe two? I'm not sure if I'm remembering them or the the Deliza placements uh, placements for them. I think there's one in there. Yep. What? Did I not hit it? Well, we're teleporting. Oh, yeah, that's great placement for me, game. Thanks. Well, maybe I should, you know, wait until the end of the round to try this. Let's not choke at the finish here. Come on. Just because we're trying to do an Easter egg doesn't mean we can... Uh, we need to fail. Ah! Zombie, 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 zombie. Please don't do this to me. Oh my word! Oh, this is gonna feel good. Feel good. Yep. That felt just as good as I thought it would. Okay, where are these? These hide and seek targets on on the giant. Is there one in there? I know where two are now because I found the one in the in the one place. That's not helpful at all. But over there in the uh, the vat, I guess. Hey, I found one. I can hear that. Now. I feel so bad for Maxis. Honestly, I feel worse for Samantha. Second one. I don't remember where the third one is. I know in World of War there's one up there, but there's it's it's been moved since. I want to think you have to be up here to see it, but I don't know why I'm remembering that. I, I, 
thought it was. Oh, it is up there. I know where and when you are. Sooner or later, I will find you. Sooner or later, I will find you. Together, evil is a force in this world. Children, an evil force. Huh. Well, that was fun. We managed to do an Easter egg. Sweet. See, I thought it was up there, but I thought it was on top of the rail, like right there. Also, the the, the reticle for the SVG 100 scope. I've always thought it looks like Glados from Portal. Like I can't help but see Glados whenever I see it. it. Doesn't help that I'm a huge fan of Portal. Ooh, that'd be a fun fun game to play here. Maybe I can get somebody to co-op with too. That'd be actually really fun. Get out of here, zombies! Oh no, I don't have a gobble gum, so I need to be carefuler. And carefuler runs through a tiny corridor. Love that. Sniper. Ah. Don't want to choke right at round 20. Because it's not hard, it's just super time consuming to, to do. Whoa, 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 why are you hitting me? Okay, now I can go on to Dysandra. For the final map of the night. Yeah, I'm trying to do at least half of a half of a game at a time, because it is only three maps per game or six maps per game rather. So it's not it's not too bad, all things considered. <laughs> and honestly, the Eisendrach is super fun. 52,000 points, exactly. How rare is that to get a proper, like, solid thousand points? <sighs> it's a good, it's good to have a, have a break every now and again from, uh, from the bigger games and just relaxing, doing, doing the stuff that I'm most useful or useful? Used to. 52,000 points, exactly. It's just crazy to me. What did I unlock, first of all? I'm just doing a quick scan to see what I unlocked, and then I'll get right back into it. Quick draw and a reflex. And the Shiva. Great. The Vesper. I got a uh, Varix. Who is going to use a scope on an SMG? Really? Why? Why would anyone put a scope on an SMG? Oh yeah, that's so cool. The robots are completely indestructible, said Rick Toffin on Origins. What do you call that, Rick? What, what, what do you call that, Rick Toffin? Hmm? Edward? Looks to me like it got taken out by a, by a Panzer Shrek pretty easily. Oh, great, I'm Dempsey. Field report. German war machine she commandeered suffered a malfunction. And when I say a malfunction? Okay, there. <laughs> Say. That's a little bit more than a malfunction, Dempsey. You got blown up. In plain sight. Really? Why? From how the characters describe it, Gobblegum's pretty terrible. Jeez. 
stabbing zombies. Nest, of all that. Richthofen! Richthofen! Is that you? Oh! Being dealt from you with Jens the first. You're not Dr. Groff. It's me. It's me. Reports of my demise. My sir. Erroneous. Ah, I love how Richthofen can just adopt the role of his. Other dimension, other universal selves. Fairly accurately, admittedly. Well, I mean, he is him. Stab the zombie again. Stabbing zombies. Try and do a better job She's really. Why am I doing Christmas songs? About two minutes. Attempts to recover the missing test subject have already hit a snafu.